Mr. President, you have to do something because, in the words of Dalton, it's going to get worse before it gets better. So I'll contact uh, Governor Romney right now. Get him on the phone. Mitt, I'm sorry, Governor Romney. Um, Governor, I got to be honest with you at, at this juncture. Um, after the last two weeks ago, what you've done to me, I'm, I'm just, I'm not equipped to deal with a beast of your stature. Is there any possible way that I could have Vice President Biden fill in for me today? Because I'm just really not feeling good right now, and I just think it would be make a better debate right now, because I'm just not feeling good today, and at this juncture, I just, I'm not, I'm not equipped to deal with the beast of your stature. Is there any possible way, Mr. Uh, Romney? <laughs> you mean you want me to let you have Vice President Joe Biden take your place tonight because you're feeling a little bit wheezy? <laughs> You know, President, the people have known as you, the President of the United States, for a reason. Not to back down from a challenge. Looks like I ruffled your feathers a little bit last week and you want to back down. My answer to that is going to be undeniably no. This is a debate the American people want to see. And you're just going to have to step your game up this week and stop making excuses. Well, um, that being said, is there any way that you could possibly, um, maybe take it easy on me because... Like I say, I'm not equipped to deal with the beast of your stature. I'm usually reading teleprompters and all that, and uh, making speeches in front of uh, idiots. But um, I've never had to sit in front of a camera and debate you one-on-one. -on -one. Is there anything else? Anything I could do? I mean, the New England Patriots are way better than my Chicago Bears. Um, Derrick Rose is terrible compared to uh, Ray John Rondo. I mean, anything of that magnitude that I can... Say that would make you change your mind, Mr. Uh, Governor uh, Romney? We've already known that Ray John Rondo was better than Derrick Rose, and we've already known that the New England Patriots are better than the Chicago Bears. Emphatically, I will tell you this right now, that does not change the fact that I will debate you tonight, and you're just going to have to um, face reality. It is what it is. Um, I can't help it, the teleprompters aren't allowed. And uh, you're just going to have the man up and face the beast of my stature. You have a good evening, President. Okay, Governor Romney, I'm sorry to hear that, and uh, I'm not looking forward to it, but um, I guess I'll be seeing you tonight later on, and um, we'll see what happens. Goodbye. He said no. He said no. Jeez, I'm not equipped to deal with such a beast of a stature. I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. He, Biden's not an option. He wanted to have Vice President Biden take his place because he's feeling a little sick under the weather. <laughs> That's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. <laughs> Anyway, you got everything going? Yeah, let's go out to Applebee's for a quick bite to eat before the debate.